HTTV in association with Absolute Warehouse Services, joining Jan Siva after a, a first win as Huddersfield Town Head Coach. Jan, you've just said to our broadcast colleagues there, everyone's really pleased for you, but you're keen to say this is all about the players tonight. Yes, definitely. They won on the pitch and they left their heart on the pitch and maybe, as I said right before in the press conference, at least what we can expect is 100% effort. And I wanted to show a different face because they were so disappointed after the game in Newcastle in the dressing room and they showed it. And they know that I believe in it and I believe in them. So today they definitely deserve the credit of all of us. You said uh, in the pre-match press conference that after such a hard game at Newcastle with 10 men, you'd need some fresh legs. Yeah. You certainly gave the team fresh legs, eight changes. How do you think, in particular, D'Amico De Haney, Carl and Grant on their first starts for us, the young players, but they did you proud tonight? They made me proud, definitely made me proud, and I'm uh, proud to have them in my team. Also, Domenico, we have, a, uh, we have had a look on him hmm. um, since a few weeks now, and he did great today, this evening. Also, Carl and Grant, I think everyone knows so why I signed him, hmm. and the most important thing for me is don't put too much pressure on them. I know they still will need time, but um, don't, put, don't, don't put too much pressure on them. You could feel as the game wore on, you could feel the momentum building, you could hear the crowd noise start to lift, you could see the attacking more and more. And then, Did you always feel that that goal would come at the end? I don't know why, but I believed that the goal would come. And at the end it came and I said the, boy, the boys in the dressing room in half time, so maybe we've just the one chance because Wolverhampton is very well organised and they're, they're doing great since the whole of the season. But at the end, uh, the boys deserved it so much and they put the ball in the net. As a head coach, when you bring substitutes onto the pitch, you need them to make an impact. And I thought that Janino Bakuna, Aaron Moy, both really made impacts when they came on the pitch tonight. Definitely. And the, the three you mentioned now were players which I directly picked from the beginning. But they had tired legs also, of course, their, their head was tired because it was such a disappointment in Newcastle. But they showed it's a team who wins games. Mm. It's not an individual. And today they showed it more than ever. Steve Mounier had a, a good game, he had two big chances that he, he almost made himself in the game and then how pleased are you for a striker like Steve to, to get that goal right at the end, it'll do him a lot of good, won't it? I think uh, that I'm so proud because um, you know, as a striker you need a feeling of scoring and today he showed everyone that he's a striker and that he has really quality and I'm proud that he made his first goal. How proud and how pleased are you for the supporters as well? Because, like you said, they've had to wait a long time for, for, to see the team win, but you could feel at the final whistle that was a, a special atmosphere at the end. I think s since the beginning, when I arrived here, they supported us right from the beginning, and it's incredible how brilliant they are. Also, when we had our defeats, but to be fair, I can't really believe it. Mm. They're so, they so great, and... Um, it's not just a squad, it's not just the staff, it's not just the club, it's all of us. And the supporters, they are so great that they deserve it as much as everyone else in the club. When you have such a big moment like we've had this evening, how much impact do you think this can give the team now moving forward, at looking at Brighton at the weekend and beyond that, to get that win, to finally get over that, that problem? I told them, I will fight until the end and the Leds will also do. So we will keep on fighting, we have 10 more games to go and many things are possible. Yeah, thanks very much and well done tonight. Thank you.